<laughs> hey you we are obviously in minecraft we are in the quilt wire server today and we're over at timber fawn's place you can see her in the in the cool shades there across the room now i, I gotta okay i i just gotta start you guys have seen some of the portal stations that these people have been submitting me to and and she says no no my portal station's just like yours um <clears throat> I beg to differ. <laughs> okay. I said, oh, you mean you just have a little box and you don't need, you know, crystal chandeliers and you don't feel like you need a tux and a glass of champagne to walk through? And she said, no, no, no. Mine's just a little box. Well, she has a different definition of freaking box than I do. <laughs> so, uh, I have a little box. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta make this a thing. I have got to get a portal station that is so over the top insane. <laughs> just to keep up this is beautiful she has vaulted ceilings <laughs> oh my goodness seating areas if i put a chair in you wouldn't be able to get to my portal <laughs> Come on. it'd block the door it would just put in a chair i don't need a door anymore <laughs> uh <-huh. coughs> this is fabulous so here we are in timber the, fun go ahead the oh. advisor has um reappeared is, he? is there yes. anything good what's in it oh my goodness little clay okay that's never bad an original book for timber fawn wow no kidding well that's cute yeah did anybody ever figure fun. out who he was nope but he started <laughs> back up again <laughs> of you who may not know what we're laughing at. <coughs> when did this happen? When did it first start? I can't remember when it started. Like six months ago. It was seven months ago. <clears throat> Somebody called the advisor was leaving these chests at, at our portal stations with gifts and weird things in them and you know anything from from a diamond sword or a pile of emeralds to clay mud. <laughs> You never really knew what you were going to get. Mm -hmm. But, um, and then he was showing up in, in chats <coughs> in different places and nobody ever knew who he was, which is kind of interesting. Well, you assume he's somebody on the server, <laughs> but, but we, we, we spent a lot of time speculating like, well, did this happen when we were logged out and we were all like watching the server lists and who was logging in at what time? <laughs> And we never did sort it. We never did figure it out. <coughs> God, I love this house. This house has been rebuilt. It's not the original one that's been here from the beginning. Well, this is nice. <laughs> I love it, it's four floors. I love the roof. Okay, first of all, I got to get it and show some details here. So she's got the roof here, and then you've got the little gap with the windows tucked down in it so you can plant flowers. And then over here, you know, you've got just that little, just that little extra bit of something, just a couple mm -hmm. of, uh, you know, you go out one block and then you add the overhang and it gives you this amazing architectural detail. Look. I also noticed there's a block missing. I wonder when that got punched out of there. I didn't do it. Just this one time. <laughs> it wasn't me. <laughs> I God, I hope it wasn't me. No, it wasn't me. <laughs> no. I know I think... just went around the corner I'm like, huh? I, just, I don't think it, I really don't think it was me this one time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting anywhere near anything anybody has built ever again. But look how pretty. Oh, the cat's in the window. Oh no, she's moving. And look the like the go? two the two um steps, how that works out and, and check out the roof, okay? So you've got the step 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 thing which we've all done and then she's added the straight bit here in the middle and it gives it just like a whole different line god this is beautiful this is like outstanding oh i love this place a lot of fun no kidding okay dare i come no, in yeah yeah, just uh, mind you, the dog. You just open the door. I, I don't want to hit. I'm not touching my mouse. I'm just. <laughs> I'm touching nothing. <gasps> Do you have enough dogs? This is a really scary <laughs> house. <laughs> it's like. You got a cat too. Look at, look at all the eyes watching you when you walk in. It's like. 
don't touch anything. <laughs> you in all kinds of trouble. We were over at Olympic Park today uh, looking at the little athletes village and we saw Emma's house and I hadn't realized that was Emma's. A very different style for her. It's, it's very interesting, quite pretty. But when you walked in the gate, which you couldn't actually see from outside, but when you walked in, it, the little teeny tiny little postage stamp front yard had a bunch of horses and donkeys and dogs. And it was just, gee, man, about right. animals. It's like, oh, this must be Emma's. Hi, kitty. Aren't you cute? Yeah, that first little house that I had, I had discovered that... Um, when I discovered that creepers didn't like cats, man, I had cats on. <laughs> I, I had more cats than torches for a long time. And I have a lot of torches, so. Yes, and then you put the gates up to keep the critters off yes. the bed. I like it, except. No, there's a wild cat. <laughs> oh. oh, to keep him from eating the dogs. That's good. He she roams to a lot. Bed. Okay, this is nice. <laughs> You and Emma, you're our animal people. <laughs> and it goes up one more floor. And then the detail again in here. I mean, she could have just made that a wall across there, but by putting, you know, the little, just the corner bits, that all gets to show through, and it's just gorgeous. That is so pretty. And we have a computer because, you know, she might want to play Minecraft or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you never know. Okay, this is lovely. I like the, you know, the loft kind of feeling going on. Oh, and look at the view. Ah, oh, so nice. I've been over at the house you made for me quite a few times lately, actually. I think I have uh, food planted so I cannot starve <laughs> to death when I'm here. <laughs> and, and I have uh, a little bed in and some places to sit outside. <laughs> Did a bit of decorating. Downstairs is just storage. It looks like Mine's just snake. pickles. <laughs> <laughs> pickles. <laughs> it's big, just storage in this cavernous room. <laughs> and look at this. She has things labeled. We have leather. We have bone meal. We have marble. Yeah, I keep meaning to do that. Today, um, Someone on the district said, uh, you know, has somebody got some glowstone to trade? I went, yeah, I do. I've been working in the nether and I've got my little house that I can stay safe in. And I've noticed in, in the biomes of plenty nether, you've got flesh that you're walking on mm -hmm. in the nether. And that grossed me out so bad. <laughs> I have spent hours putting in just stone walkways in the air so I don't have to walk on the ground. It's like, it's so gross. I can't handle it. I can't even think about it. It's just, yeah. Ha, ha. So I said, yeah, I've got some, and I've got it in a chest. Um, mm, I, I wonder where that is. And it's like going from house to house and checking yeah. down in the basement and upstairs. And This is so pretty. All the enchanted tools and weapons. And then she's got the serious... You got a bodyguard. Whoa! <laughs> <I turned around. laughs> it's so sorry. I've got two of those over in Walker's Castle, but, and they scare me a lot. When I'm, If I haven't been there in a while and I'm putzing along and the place is big enough, I've had to leave myself signs because I, I tend to get lost. And, and I'll walk in a room and one of those suckers are walking toward me and I just about leave my chair every time. Ah, oh, goodness. Yep. I didn't even use that. I just threw it in. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. And she has, you know, cake on hand for those midnight snacks when she's working too right. late. Or maybe that's what she feeds pickles on. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, Watch the door. All the little dogs. Okay, I don't have to. I mean, it's going to close. Nope. Lovely. It closes automatically. That is a fabulous house. I should have you come build me one just like it over in Midsummer Meadows. <laughs> that can be done. Oh, that is so beautiful. I love this place. Just lay down your color palette on the ground, what blocks you want, and it'll be done. Yeah. <laughs> I can do this. 
And then you got the stables. And timber the mini, being timber. Any stables. Is, uh, remember what I said about the animal people? <sighs> do you know how many, an, do you know how many horses you own? Um, a lot. <laughs> I didn't think so. <laughs> okay, we have one, two, three, four here. <laughs> You're going to be counting a while. Too many. Oh my god. And they're named. I love it. Eight, nine, ten. Oh, Palomino. And then I won't know what I've can. Oh, there's a whole another row. Oh, there's more than one. In it. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I've already lost. It. <laughs> and you know, it goes all the way down there. There's row back along the back wall. Each one of these stalls has a horse, maybe two. <laughs> well, some might be empty. I don't know. Is this empty? Yeah, that one's empty. Okay. See, no, oh, gates open. They would be empty yeah, if the gates, gates are were open. open but... Oh, my goodness gracious. At one point in time, this portal did work. <coughs> the horse portal to Impex. You guys are just moving, moving the horses, <laughs> moving some horse flesh around. No. I love it. Yeah, that was what <laughs> before we actually had the horses themselves. So Impact and I were trading the Mo Creature horses back and forth ah, okay. to breed to get the different colors. Yeah, I wish we hadn't lost those. You know, it, it's fine that, oh, we've added new horses in them, but why did you have to use the same slots as the actual pretty horses is my question. <laughs> <laughs> That's just... Because mm. I really don't really care for the... I just really don't care for the new horses near as much. Mm -hmm. I do still have some one of the Moes. That's yeah, these, these guys two. over here. These two, the donkeys and the um, the zebra, yeah, these guys. are the only ones. Yeah, there's a zebra. Yeah, yeah, those are the only four that weren't written over. So it's unfortunate. That's all I've got. Yeah, that's too bad. Because I find the, well, maybe it's just the mod pack we're using, the, the texture pack, but, okay, the the eyes on these, they're, they're that's just creepy. <laughs> <laughs> these are they like are. demon horses or something. <laughs> oh my goodness. A nice little training ring. Look at the s <clears throat> size of this, guys. <laughs> that's a lot of horses. <laughs> and you Most have... all of them are broke oh, to ride. Of course they are. I mean, there would be no point in keeping them otherwise, right? Mm-hmm. Testing oh. them all for speed. Oh. Jump abilities. That's right. You do that, too. <laughs> mm-hmm. And then notice over there she has her own dragons. Because yeah. what would a home be without a dragon? I mean. <laughs> Every house needs a wavering pen, right? At least the one. I've never had one. I mean, I, I had them only at um, only at the, the fairgrounds. The hallowed harvest fell ground. Oh, the gold thing is pretty. And big. Yeah, Chris. Our impact has one just like it. I think might still have one. And she's red. There's red, green, and yellow. They are, are the beautiful. mothers. Wow, that's a big girl. Mm-hmm. And then there's a start of a little village. It has two houses so far. <laughs> <laughs> and you've got fields for food oh yeah tons and tons of food gotta feed the horses obviously oh, okay oh, we've got a ton of cows back here and a little barn or a shed of some sort yeah the barn's still original and the chicken coop but there's no chickens in it lady uh moosington my the the girl that is over on the district now from scotland the one who was visiting here uh, a while ago um, she had never played Minecraft till she joined and she told me today that she's, you know, ordered some ma manuals so she can learn all the stuff she doesn't know, <laughs> but she's got so many chickens and, uh, and she's got like a double gateway so they can't get out. And I said, Oh, well, that was really smart because they're kind of hard to, you know, coming out. And she just kind of exclaimed, Oh, those chickens. <laughs> There's obviously a story <laughs> there somewhere. <laughs> It was pretty good. Yeah, that can be fun. <laughs> I 
I forgot how far a walk this was. It's been a while since I've been here. <clears throat> Hey, you're building, you've been doing a lot of, of underground stuff, haven't you? Like, massive. I haven't actually touched the underground. I've been going above the surface. Oh, moving into the light. How oh, nice. Yeah. <sighs> so I just got the two houses, one there and one back over that You direction. have a roundabout. I love this. <laughs> <laughs> I was just talking about this. I was, I was talking about this to Ascension. I said, I don't have a roundabout. What is wrong with me? <laughs> oh my goodness. That's perfect. It's your oh. older style homes. Look how pretty. <coughs> and if it's older, then did you used to have flower pots on the thing that we lost when we did this last upgrade here a few weeks ago? No. Oh, good. Nope. I've lost so much. It's going to take me three months of putting flower pots back to... Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello. I know that voice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was, I was looking around the other day and <clears throat> I was showing some people some things and I, I said, this doesn't look right. It's everything's so weird. And I could, I couldn't, I just couldn't get my head around what it was. And uh, I was at the, the front of the Georgian townhouses that I'd made and, and I'd had different like plantings and flower pot arrangements and stuff in front of each one. They were very individual. And I realized they all looked the same because they were all gone. And and I went, <laughs> no, and started looking at all these houses. I plant, I decorate a lot in flower pots. <laughs> oh my God. I was just, <sighs> it's going to be a while. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, let me check on uh, something for Yorkie. He might be here, and it's done. I had checked just a minute ago, and it wasn't. So it's nice. ready. The backup is done. Good stuff. I just have to sort out Sartex. Oh yes, thank you. That's nice when it's just installed because people are always asking me, "Well, what is it you're using?" And mine don't look the same. And where do I get it? And it's nice when it can just be there. This is beautiful. Again, you have the best houses. <laughs> I try to stay that. the towards the, you know, more of the gothic or old style houses. Hey guys, check out the details. I mean, look at you know how she kind of ducks something in there, and then you've got the pillar and the thing on the top and. Oh. Then it's not even finished yet. Oh my goodness, my goodness. And the trim on the roof, that is something I like so much. And I, I do it and then I forget a lot. You, you mm -hmm. know, when you're putting a roof up <laughs> and you've had all those steps that you've been trying to line up and you reach a point where you just don't care anymore. You just want it done. <laughs> And then I forget to put the trim on. And then I, I think about it later and go, oh, the next one, I'm going to do all the trim. And I love that two-tone. And oh, and then you get the roof on. And at the end, it's just like, okay, I'm done. I don't care. I just don't care. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I love it that oh, you care. Uh, yep. Yeah. Um, I added something that you don't know about. <laughs> <laughs> surprises for me <laughs> oh you will love this surprise well for those of you listen watch you know who sees this recording right now we've been playing over on the district today and it's down it's offline at the moment and hey hey Yorkie is putting in new things and we've been playing with all the new toys and it's very exciting and now apparently there's going to be more surprises so <laughs> <laughs> yay it sounds good you know, I was commenting earlier, you guys have broken me. It's like, I don't want mods. Mods are a pain. They crash. They go wrong. They mess up. You know, you can't do this. You can't upgrade that. If they don't get upgraded, you lose stuff. It's blah, 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 blah. I don't want mods. I don't want mods. And it's not, I need more. <laughs> 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 oh, God. More stuff to break the server with. Absolutely. <laughs> But I'm learning to fix the server, so it's not quite as bad as it used to be. So this is going to be really nice. What a lovely mm -hmm. house. This is really And I'll have great. it just kind of wrapped around and 
I got it all mapped out where I'll have all the houses. And... You've mapped out your village? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I kind of got torches wherever there's torches, there's going to be a little grouping of houses. Okay, so there's something and there's something. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at the little spots of light all over. Oh my god, and over there and further back there. Oh my goodness, girl. Nice. Really nice. But this, these, these will be done in survival. Since no. I went into creative, I haven't touched them. <laughs> will I not know. touch these. The people on this server so. get creative for various reasons when we're doing one thing or another. And sometimes you just, you know, you forget to take it off or you're not in line the same time they are. And then they start sending me these messages. Will you please come in and get creative? <laughs> 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 it's like, if I'm not... I laugh about Emma. If she can't die by falling off everything, then, then life mm -hmm. is just not exciting. So, Or burning by fire or lava. Yeah. 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 No, I'm working on an event. <coughs> oh. So that's why I have creative. We get a few events coming up. I know um, Antoon has been working, or uh, Aver mm -hmm. Cameron, sorry, has been working on a, a, an event for quite a while. In, yes. uh, in survival, and I guess we'll be doing something with that um, over the, for the winter frost holidays at some point. I I don't even know what it is. All I know is there's <laughs> an entire event finished. <laughs> it's like okay, yep. fine. And we all have we got invitation books for them. Oh, that's right. He had sent me a sample one. I might have one kicking around mm -hmm. somewhere too. Then I haven't seen it yet, but it was pretty it's impressive. What? <laughs> it's really cute. <laughs> The first page is nothing but his name. Yes, you know, the many titles and the protector mm -hmm. of and the lord and the leader and the king and the thing and the oh my god. Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> it. was funny. It was awesome. I loved it. But other than that, that's not really much. I started building the event and I focused on that and that's why I stayed. Hmm. You know, and I know I've, I've recorded in all of your worlds before, but I'm, I just want everybody to have their own playlist now. And I'm thinking about going, you know, doing a quick once over of the things from the past so people don't have to go and search through however many hundreds of videos are now online to find these mm -hmm. things. So, um, you know, starting with this cute little village. <clears throat> Although, Timberfawn joined the server, and that was about the first thing she did. You want to talk about intimidating. <laughs> You, you invite this nice lady who you, you don't really know. And it seems like she knows a little bit about Minecraft. And I, of course, knew nothing at the time. And I come over here, you know, to say hello. And I see this in front of me. And I'm doing that little tiny, tiny, tiny house with a few stalls. You know, the barn that I was making. <laughs> and luckily at the time. And I come over and saw this and kind of went, Okay, I have really been thinking about this game wrong. <laughs> just, I didn't know. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is remarkable. That's just the start of the world. That's just the entrance gate to say, hi, now you're here. Yeah, that's the yep. good part, guys. So I'm going to yep. stop this recording here so they have some awesome things to look forward to and this goes on for quite a ways and I'm going to be doing a, um, a series of recordings of all the many houses and homes that people have made been kind enough to make for me and I will be up the path here um, a good ways but it goes on for a while it does so I guess this this little cottage over here this is just the uh, portal keepers house yep pretty much cushy job <laughs> oh mm -hmm. my goodness this you is play with all the animals and farm and yeah oh this is lovely thank you so much timber this is absolutely gorgeous and yeah we'll have to take a quick walk through some of the other bits that you're doing it we've already recorded in the past just to give a you know a bit of a a flow to the to the playlist and then get on to whatever well i guess we don't get to see the event till we get to see the event huh yep i had to wait okay i can do that <laughs> well if you want a sneak peek you can have one but not it just won't be recorded no they, they just boss me around it's awesome <laughs> oh she giggles she's yeah i know <laughs> oh look at that no okay fine scott's been saying no i don't even get to see so i don't even get to see i just he's now he's bossing you around too <laughs> 
So the problem is, is you can see it from your island. <clears throat> yeah, but I've been busy decorating and planting and reading <laughs> books. I have, I honestly haven't noticed. I, I actually have no idea what you're talking about. Um, so maybe I won't go back to my island for a while. No, it's fine. Uh, but yeah, I, no, I haven't seen it at all. So there you go, guys. This is just a little village, just a cute little thing, you know, nice little buildings. And life is in the details. The work these people put into stuff, this is just amazing. Life's in the details. And it's built beautiful. <laughs> so thank you, Tim Fun. Say goodbye until we see you guys next time. Live your life happy and build it beautiful. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.